Uttar Pradesh proves to be one of the best places to pursue technical education in India. It is evident from the number of premier institutions from this state on the NIRF table. It also holds the pride of having the most number of IITs and various other private institutions. Today, we are reviewing an institution that adds up to the list of well-reputed institutions from Uttar Pradesh. Welcome to College Suggest. And in this video, we review the Motilal Nehru National Institute of Technology, Allahabad. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon to receive notifications on your favorite college details, college comparisons, courses, careers, and a whole lot more. As always, we will only consider the facts that are submitted by the college to the NIRF for the 2019 ranking. We leave the link in the description below. Motilal Nehru National Institute of Technology, Allahabad was established as one of the 17 regional engineering colleges of India in the year 1961. For a short duration of two years, from 2000 to 2002, the institute was affiliated to UP Technical University. With over 45 years of experience and achievements in the field of technical education, on June 26, 2002, the institute was transformed into the National Institute of Technology and deemed university fully funded by the Government of India. In 2007, the institute was granted the status of an institution of national importance. Now let us analyze this institution's score under various parameters as set by the NIRF. The institution has scored 63.13% in teaching, learning and resources. In research and professional practices, the institution has scored 28.39%. While in graduation outcomes, the score is 65.55%, it has scored 49.49% in outreach inclusivity. The score for the perception of this institution is 19.77% and this is the lowest score on the list. With all of these scores, the institution has scored a total of 47.49 as their NIRF score. This score has contributed to progressing the institution's rank to the 42nd position. With a rise in ranking, it proves to be an institute with total commitment to quality and excellence in academic pursuits. MNNIT is located in Teliyar Ganj, Allahabad. The nearest railway station to the institution is Allahabad Junction, which is 7.5 kilometers away. And the nearest airport to the institution is the Lal Bahadur Shastri International Airport, which is 126 kilometers away. MNNIT's campus spreads over 222 acres with well-laid roads and beautiful buildings that create a better environment for students to be able to concentrate on and chase their dreams. The library is the heart of teaching and research. The Central Library has a collection of over 1 lakh books and bound periodicals. It also subscribes to 53 Indian and 237 international technical periodicals. In order to facilitate both students and staff to be able to select reading materials of their choice, access to Stacks is open to all library members. The Institute offers 7 boys and 2 girls hostels. These hostels can accommodate a total capacity of 1,945 students. Each room has a chair, a study table, a tea table, a cot, a fan, and other basic needs of the students. Hostel messes are managed by nominated representatives of students under the overall supervision of wardens. The messes promise to serve tasty and healthy food. MNNIT encourages its students to take part in various activities. The institute's grounds can be used for various outdoor games, while the Student Activity Center has facilities for many indoor games. Sports and athletic teams of the institute participate in intercollegiate events regularly. The admission process is the same for all the NITs. Admission to undergraduate engineering programs for candidates from India is based on their rank in the Joint Entrance Examination, Main. For PG admissions, candidates must have a valid GATE score. The institute offers 9 UG, 20 PG and 1 PG 3-year course, which is the MCA program. MNNIT has an approved intake of 937 UG seats, 583 PG seats and 93 MCA seats. The overall student count is moderate. The institution has a total of 5,106 engineering students, out of which 84.49% are boys and 15.51% are girls. The institute has an almost equal number of students from within the state and outside the state. 
There are 2,352 students from Uttar Pradesh, 2,343 students from other parts of India, and 411 students from abroad. There are 295 full-time and 107 part-time students pursuing their PhDs. Last year, 21 full-time and 20 part-time students graduated with a doctorate. When it comes to graduation, the UG and MCA program has shown better results, while the PG two-year program needs some improvement. UG graduations have improved to 91.95% and 3.94% of the graduates have decided to study further. PG graduations have slid to 73.39%, out of which 16.08% of the students opted to go for higher studies. The MCA program had a perfect graduation outcome, but this was later dropped to 91.39%. 3.52% of the students chose to go for higher education. Only the UG placements are above average and the rest of the programs need to focus on improving their placements. The UG placements progressed to 84.10% by employing 656 students. The placed students were offered a median salary package of 7.95 lakhs per annum. PG placements have shown a good progression as well. Last year, 50.52% of the students were placed. The number of students employed is 145 and these students were given a salary of 6 lakhs per annum. The MCA program has shown a mild improvement in its placements by progressing itself to 64.63%. A total of 53 students were placed for a median salary package of 5.85 lakhs per annum. Tech giants who hire from MNNIT are Google, Yahoo, Microsoft, Tata Motors, Samsung, Qualcomm, Oracle, Infosys, Deloitte, and many more. MNNIT has a highly talented crew of professors who constantly work on providing the best to their students. The institute consists of 260 faculty members, out of which 81.53% hold a doctorate, and there is one faculty member for every 20 students. The NIRF parameter research and professional practices clearly show that the institute needs improvement under its research activities. However, this institute encourages its students to involve themselves in various research and developmental programs in their area of interest. Over the past years, the number of patents published has improved to one, while no patents were granted. The research projects bring over 7 crores as sponsored research funding and over 2 crores were received as consultancy project funding. The capital expenditure spent by the institution is quite less when compared to its peers. Over 11 crores were spent as capital expenditure out of which most of the amount was spent on creating capital assets. Over 119 crores were spent as the annual operational expenditure out of which 50.05% was spent on the salaries of the staff. Kalrav is the annual cultural festival of the Motilal Nehru National Institute of Technology. Every year, the event approximately witnesses a footfall of over 25,000 students from various colleges. It is one of the biggest inter-college cultural festivals in North India. The festival draws students from most reputed colleges across the country. Just like cultural events, academic activities also take place in a grand fashion. The institution brings in professionals from various fields of engineering for guest lectures as well as seminars. The facts clearly show the ups and downs of the institution in various aspects. The institution's graduation outcome is a strength and this has been maintained in a better way. There is a big expectation on the institution to scale up its placements as well. The placement cell of the institution constantly works on placing students for a better salary package. Research practices are an integral part of any technical institution, and MNNIT needs more focus on this particular parameter, which would bring it up on the table. The efficient crew of faculty members adds strength to this institution. The constant betterment of this institution sets high hopes to see it in an even better place on the NIRF table. What other interesting college reviews would you like to see? Let us know in the comment section below. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and for more information, visit collegesuggest.com.